How's it going guys, Mr. Drinkwater here. Uh, today I thought we'd do a little bit of a breakdown after the trailer that we saw last night, as you can see here. Knock him down, yeah. kill him, whack him up. So, as we know, Godzilla's not the only one of his species. Uh, there was another version of himself. Um, well, I'm not sure if that would be him in this new trailer, but as for certain, as a lot of people have speculated out there so far, that might not be Godzilla. It looks like him, and sounds like him, and he's got similar powers to him, but what might be a possibility is that might be Mecha Godzilla. But at the same time, as you can see here in the trailer, this imagery here, then it would confirm that the Godzilla, the new one, the Mecha Godzilla, is uh, a metal sort of exoskeleton. Um, I'm not too sure on the certain aspects uh, of how Kong's going to compete to that. Uh, I, like I said yesterday, I've always been a Kong fan, but I believe that Kong has a little bit of a disadvantage in this one um, as to the fact of how armor works, uh, powers itself. Um, the only thing he's got on his side is brute strength and intelligence. He's more intelligent than Godzilla. Uh, unfortunately, Mecha Godzilla is going to be run by people, so us, for example. But I don't think it's going to compare to Kong's intelligence, unfortunately, because the monster's been around for millions of years in the Godzilla and Kong universe. Now, what from what we know from the trailer is that Kong's brute strength clearly overpowers Godzilla, as we saw uh, on the warship at the first scene, right? Now, I don't know what this little girl has to do with this. Um, all we know is that she was taken care of by Kong. Now, I, was, I would assume she's from Skull Island. Now, I want to know what this this little um, voodoo Kong bear, like teddy bear thing means. Is she controlling him? Uh, it's uncertain, but when she's shown Kong, uh, he seemed to be obedient and kneeled down in the trailer, so we we know that she's going to have a main role in this somehow. Now, I have a theory, but I'm not too certain if it's going to be true or not. But my theory would be that Kong and Godzilla are going to team up. Now, once they've had their little battle, uh, they're going to team up and they're going to fight Mecha Godzilla and the new monster that's meant to be appearing in this. Now, another part of the trailer that I noticed was... Godzilla, um, the second version of himself in the comics, there was an exoskeleton blue sort of like glowing um, like shape on the floor that Kong was stood on. Now, we know from Kong in 1970s, which was the 2017 Kong Skull Island movie, he was a lot shorter than he was now. He's massive now. He's grown at least an extra, double his height, an extra 100 feet on top of what he was before. Now, if you see here, he was actually quite small compared to the Godzilla skeleton that was on the floor. Now, that speculates to me that Godzilla's not fully hit his size yet. So, that's a comparison for Godzilla. Now, we don't know, but we do realise that some species out in real life, they uh, adapt to their environment and their other predator foes and also prey, so they don't get eaten or they, they actually become a predator instead. So they grow in different ways, they emotionally change, their aggressiveness, everything, their intelligence changes to different areas of the world, different environments. Now, I don't know if that's gonna be the same sort of uh, thing in this sort of universe, but I guess we are going to find out. But my main theory so far is that Godzilla and Kong are obviously having a, obviously having a fight first. That's what we know. Uh, once that's been completed and they've actually settled their differences, that there can't be no one king, because neither one of them will bow to the other. They're going to have to team up against the human race using Mecha Godzilla. Now, in my opinion, the human race are making a big mistake here, because Godzilla's been their protector for so many years in the Godzilla universe, and Kong has been a protector of Skull Island for over a few, few million years. Uh, so... You know, it's it's kind of a weird forte at the moment. We've got we've got a little bit to wait on. Now, it hasn't been confirmed yet, 
but there's been rumours of a trailer 2 coming out. So hopefully that one will give us uh, more information. We know that the film's coming out this year, 2021. Um, I don't know how it's going to premiere with obviously the pandemic and the virus being around. But I'm pretty sure we're going to find out the ins and outs by trailer 2. It'll give us a main date. Um, what I'll do is I'll do another video on trailer 2 to speculate the inside um, efforts uh, between them both. So make sure you stay tuned and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I will also keep up to date with the Kong and Godzilla universe if you enjoy that. Uh, also check out my other gaming videos and my other horror videos. Uh, I do a lot of gaming videos as well, but I'm going to be doing some more reactions. So please send comments, anything, if you want me to react to something. And then I'll do my speculation and opinion on it. I think those are uh, going to be, a lot of them will be added to my channel. So yeah, I hope you guys have a good day. And thank you for watching. Peace. Well, I'm no one's fool.